The virus has disrupted a lot of travel plans, including those of the Pensbury High School marching band. Alexandria Hoff is at the airport tonight with their story. Alex? Well, Yuki, Jessica, those band members and staff, they had a plan. They were going to go to China from April 3rd to the 10th. It was going to be a trip of a lifetime. Well, that wasn't able to happen, and now their backup plan has been canceled as well. It is a situation that many people with future travel plans are now either fearing or facing. The kids are disappointed. They're great kids. You know, they work so hard. The Pensbury High School marching band was geared up, tuned up, and ready to go. For a year, parents and booster programs raised funds to send about 150 band members and staff to China. The price was $3,600 a person. The reward oh, yeah, to make yeah, history. In Shanghai, they would become the first marching band in the world to play all of the Disney Park resorts. They were also going to play um, on the Great Wall of China, which is so cool. But as the coronavirus outbreak took hold, a decision had to be made. The band couldn't go to China. But they had um, saved the trip, and, and so to speak, and, and got them, uh, put a trip together for them to go to France. Paul Baroli Jr.'s daughter is a band member. He and his wife decided that they would pay their own way and tag along to visit Paris. I think they must have just thought we can't take the chance of one kid getting sick over there or having one issue because we took this trip when we should have, you know, erred on the side of caution. The side of caution is what the school erred on. After learning of the coronavirus's spread in Europe this week, the trip to France, the trip as a whole, was called off. And here's where the story broadens. Many standard travel insurance policies exclude unforeseen events like a virus outbreak from coverage and therefore will not fully cover claims. From what I've been told that we're very fortunate to be getting 75 percent of, of what we paid for the trip back, that there's some schools in the area who, because of the insurance policy and how things were worded, they're not getting any of their money back. I will add that Paul's daughter, Magnolia, is a junior, so she might have a chance for another trip of a lifetime next year. Of course, not the same case for seniors in that band. But for anyone else who is planning future travel, experts say if you are concerned about the status of your trip with the coronavirus, that you should be getting a certain kind of travel insurance. It's called cancel for any reason insurance. It's pricier than those standard policies, but it does offer more protection. Reporting live from Philadelphia International Airport, Alexandria Hoff, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Alex, thank you. There is a lot of separating fact from fiction when it comes to coronavirus. That's why we have the most up-to-date information on the outbreak and how to protect yourself at CBSPhilly.com.